Hello gaming fanatics and welcome back to Risk of Rain, Beginner's Guide to Brilliantism. Today is for Acrid. Acrid um, is a melee class, his primary attack is melee, let's move my mouse off the screen. Uh, the My frame rate is dancing about a bit, hang on. I, uh, I can fix this. Uh, this happens when I record sometimes, don't know why, just does. Uh, we have the disease, which is that thing I've just fired there. There's only one of them, so I can't really demonstrate that properly. But the, uh, the disease can spread to other uh, other enemies nearby, which is a very useful thing. Let's open this shrine. Can't get anything from there. Damn it. Um, primary attack is, um, I think it's piercing by default. I'm pretty sure it's piercing by default which is quite useful. Um, this is definitely piercing. Uh, that is a short range, a short range ranged attack. So do this quickly. This is, this goo here makes you run fast. This is your third attack. Oh, you just saw a disease spread there. And um, that damages enemies that walk on it. So uh, it's quite useful. Disease you. He's spread off to a, a few people. Acrid is quite good at dealing with um, large quantities of enemies. He's a very good both multiplayer and single player class. Sometimes some classes I say are better used in multiplayer. Um, Acrid is one that's good for both. I quite like Acrid for both. He's a nice multiplayer character as well as single player character, kind of like Huntress. And I just got head stompers. Wow, that's just pretty damn useless. Although, I did actually manage to kill 20 enemies at the same time with head stompers the other day. I was quite pleased with that. Could never pull it off again. But it was it was interesting, to say the least. Wish I was recording. Sad face. Spreading the disease there. Now, the difference between Acrid, if you've seen my um, commando be getting this guy's brilliantism, um, obviously the commando is ranged, and Huntress as well is also ranged. So, because Acrid, well, he does have ranged attack, but his primary attack is melee, you do have to be a bit more careful about taking damage because there are a lot of um, melee enemies. So, how can you avoid this? Well, he's quite resilient. If I get hit a few times, health is well yeah uh, he doesn't take quite as much damage as um as you might expect from other classes i think that's the armor rating his default armor rating is a bit higher um which is quite good it means he can take a bit more of a beating than some of the other classes can so you don't have to worry as much as taking damage as you would do for like mercenary or something but fell off. Uh, oh, let's grab a droid while we're here. But you do still have to be a bit more careful due to the fact he doesn't have a sure-fire dodge. I'm like, oh, for God's sake. <laughs> I'll stop falling off in a minute. Yeah, he doesn't have a sure-fire dodge like some of the classes do, like Commando and Huntress. Huntress obviously has the blink and is it the roll for Commando? Can't remember. But you do have to be a little bit more careful there. Uh, best thing to do is to move about as I am doing. If you've got war banners, try and stand in the war banners. They can heal you. Um, try and lay down goo regularly. It can be quite good for escaping as well as dealing with hordes of enemies. Um, again, use the disease in hordes quite quite a bit you, because of the piercing attack. Uh, yes, that is piercing. Just checking the primary weapon is piercing. As you just saw, it is. Um, oh, for God's sake. I've been, um, I haven't been in the house very much recently, I've been, um, so I've been doing Risk of Rain on my laptop and the, um, the space bar's not as springy, so I keep, um, like, the reason I, like that, keep falling down holes is because I'm kind of not, uh, hitting the space bar as hard as I normally do. Which is silly of me. Yeah, Acrid is quite an easy class to play. It's quite a good um, beginner class. You unlock him, of course, by um, going to the name of the level. Sunken Tombs, there it is. 
Sunken Tombs is where you get him from. If you go into the top right of the map, there is sometimes um, a thing you can find there, a um, cage, and that is where you can get... Um, you will fight Acrid when he comes out, and that is how you unlock him. And a good class he is. There's not really much more to say about him. I've completed the first level here. Oh, Leaping Seed, nice. Um, is there anything more I can really say about him? Apart from items, perhaps. he um, Good healing items are the Leaping Seed, as they usually are. Um, oh, he's a bit faster than um, Huntress and Commando. And I did make the mistake in a previous video saying Huntress is faster than Commando. Um, she is not. That was incorrect. They are the same speed. Uh, Acrid is the one that's slightly faster. Try. I thought you might be interested to know. I think we've covered just about everything then. Um, Monster Tooth is quite a good healing item as well. War Banner is something that's definitely worth having um, because it's good for camping, as is um, Bustling Fungus. That's quite a useful thing to have. Um, items to steer clear of or that aren't as useful. Uh, Heaven Cracker is not as useful for Acrid. Um, well, it's not really useful at all for Acrid. Um, is it useful? No, it's, it's not really useful. So, um, given the choice of that in the shop, maybe not the best one to go for, but apart from that, he is generally quite a, a nice, well-rounded, easy class to play as. And probably the easiest of the melee classes. Uh, is he easier than Mr. Handy? Oh, he's not Mr. Handy, he's just Handy. Um, they're about the same, I'd say. But yes, thank you for watching Game Fanatics. If you uh, found this video helpful, please leave a like and subscribe if you want to see more. I will see you next time. Bye bye. Just in case you're interested, I'm on Sunken Tombs. Uh, conveniently came here on the same run. Here is the, uh, the little prison where you get Acrid, and there is Acrid for you to kill. Acrid versus Acrid. Who will win? Probably this Acrid. This Acrid has a lot more items. When I say this Acrid, I mean my Acrid. Wahaha. So you just kill him to unlock him, as I am doing here. Help is going down like there's no tomorrow. Screw this guy. It is me. Yep, and if you do that, I've already done it, so I didn't get, I didn't unlock him, obviously, I've already unlocked him, but, um, yeah, if you do that, to unlock him. Anyway, I'll actually end the video now. Bye-bye!